Welcome to Guess What Movie This Is. Today's guest is Julian McCullough. How are you? Good. I am not a movie. <laughs> we'll figure that out. Okay, that's for me to decide. What I'm going to do is I'm going to watch trailers on mute, and then you guys are going to decide, um, oh, whoever gets the movie right first wins absolutely nothing. Ooh. And that's what's fun about it. I can't wait. Now, before we started, I asked Andrea Allen what year I should look up, okay. and she said 1988 because... That's the year she was born. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so these are classics to her. Yes. I was like, I have so many wonderful memories. Where, I'm sorry, you were born in 19... 19- <laughs> so that's what we're working with right now. And here we go. Are you guys ready? I'm yeah. ready. Okay. So shout out whatever you think by what I'm, you know, you can interrupt everything. Um, I just want to point Ghost. out... <laughs> Ghost. Ghost 2. I want to say you're closed. Ghost but- 2. <laughs> you know what? I have a computer. It's when his buddy goes to hell and he's got to get his way out. <laughs> This trailer is four and a half minutes long. What? Thank you. And it's from 1988, which means it's literally the whole movie. Oh, do you? I'm sorry. How long are these? Can I talk? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'd love that he in asked the old days. Talk. In the old days, they used to show like full scenes yeah. in the trailers. It was crazy. Oh. They like, used to show like a whole like breakdown between two actors, like, mm. and one of them starts crying, and they're like, yeah. "This week, Kramer versus Kramer." You know, it's like right. it's insane. Yeah, yeah, Rosemary's Baby. You're watching those devil people fuck that woman, and then it goes Rosemary's Baby. I'm like, "Whoa, okay." <laughs> then it sounds like we're in for a treat. I do not watch these trailers ahead of time. So <laughs> Sorry, let's fuck that woman. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That was insensitive. Well, now he's saying woman instead of thing, so we've moved <laughs> oh, up in the world. Yeah, Keith. thank you. <laughs> Okay, sorry. Of course, check out when uh, Julian was on Keith and the Girl, and here we go. And so, right now, a lot of um, of messages are popping up on the on the screen. Okay. And what do you mean messages? Um, so like text texts, but it's not nineteen eighty eight. Te- right. So just the te- so here we go. He's scratched up behind him. He's naked. It says ho 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 and machine gun on a weird sweater. Die hard. Die hard! I said it first. Whoa! I heard it and yelled it louder. <laughs> Die hard. Die hard. Whoa! I just want you to know we were like twenty seconds into that. What are the what are the what's the messages that were going on the screen? Oh, I don't. I'll, I'll rewind. Let's see. Yeah, what message is it? Um, it says. It says Columbia Pick. <laughs> oh, okay. Honest trailers. Die hard, please. Um. Oh, okay. oh, it was like outside of the actual trailer. Yeah, I know what okay, you're doing. Okay, I see. Yeah. Yeah, the, yeah. This is a thing that's going to say all the things wrong with Die Hard, and that's what you're reading. Okay, I think, yeah, I think that was the wrong trailer. So thank you guys for playing. <laughs> you did really well. Well, we, got, we still got it. <laughs> now <laughs> You still got it. It counts. Now I do it, and it's my show? Is that how uh-huh. we do this? <laughs> you own the so show. So do I get to do one? Your name is now Keith. Okay. So we will refer oh, you. Oh, I didn't get to pick which who I get to be. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to be Hamda. <laughs> Well, because you say it perfectly, you should. Thank you. <laughs> All right, here we go. Points here are go. doubled. Okay, points are doubled, and I'm pressing play. Okay, so this is an animation, and he's like wheeling himself all kinds of like incredible. And and you're showing Wait, a crib, and you're showing a baby. It's all the same year. You're showing a baby climbing on. Look, he's talking. Nope. Um, he's lighting the baby's almost lighting himself on fire, and there's uh, the person who's watching him is not a person, but he's trying to get to him. But then the rolling pin gets in the way. Whoa, he's all framed Roger Rabbit. Yes. Oh, whoa, I was not gonna get that. I didn't think I had it. it I, <laughs> I finally get why he's here. <laughs> You finally get why the show is called Keith and the Girl. <laughs> yeah, she's the sensitive one, and he saw Roger Rabbit. <laughs> so, uh, yep, who framed Roger Rabbit? Hoskins. <laughs> you got that like 29 seconds in. Thank Here you. we go. This is the last one. This one's 2 minutes, 23 seconds. Let's see how quick you can get it. I'm pressing play now. 20th Century Fox, if that means anything to you. Once mm. again, it's from 1988 again. Uh, a kid, he's around 12, and he's like, I don't, I'm, I'm with a lot of people right now, and there's a lot of things going on, Goonies. but I don't like it. And then he walks up to this thing. Big. And he's, yes. Whoa! Can I just say I knew it 10 seconds before that, but I was like, you know, we got to have a show. No, take chances. <laughs> it was big. How did you know? 88, uh, I remember 1988, like a photographic memory. Like wow. I was, I was 88 and 89, I was nine and 10 years old. It's the only memories I have are from those two years. I don't know why. I guess wow. I blocked out everything else. She said a kid was around people, but alone. And I knew it before. She goes, there's a kid. And I was like, big. 
What? Yeah. I was about to say he put the coin into that thing, and I thought I mean, that's... that would have been embarrassing if you didn't get it by then. <laughs> Do you guys know who Jimmy Pardo is? Sure. Yeah, I love him. Phenomenal dude, right? And he's coming up on my opening line soon. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. He's so funny. And he was in the record industry for before he was a comedian. Right. And I used to have a different podcast about music, and I quizzed him on um, th that thing where you name that tune, where it's right. like the first... He literally, first note, got five songs in a row. Oh, first we, note. Keith, you're so good at that. We should test him instead of movies. We should do um, music next time he's on. Are but, you going to get it before the first note? <laughs> because, <laughs> it, it, but they all have to be hair metal to give them it some was, kind it, of... It was mostly. Well, shit. Wow, I can't wait. He got Amanda by Boston. Uh, yeah, by Boston. He got Valerie by Steve Winwood, which is easy because it's like, bump. Right. You know that opening to listeners? Still, though. Still amazing. <laughs> Sounds like we would kill it. <laughs> uh, Joanna by Cool and the Gang. Okay. And How does that go? Joanna. Oh. Well, if I can go I by first word. love <laughs> you. You're and the one. <laughs> and Sarah by Starship. Sarah. Wow. But he got him in the first... Wow, no. really impressive. So we were going to And there were three other people with him. That was the funny part. He was just like, uh, 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 uh. And wow. Like, Everybody else can leave. I was going to say check out Julian McCullough, but fuck it. Jimmy Pardo, check man. Check out Jimmy Pardo? All the way. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, Julian. Never Not Funny Podcast. It's so good. <laughs> yeah, I, th I think he won this game. All right. Thank you guys very much. Uh, thanks for spreading the word. Thanks for subscribing. That's the big deal, right? Hitting that bell. We appreciate it. Keith and the girl .com.